Everybody gonna have something to say. So y'all about to see a lot of commentary around it. Everybody is now a sports analyst. Everybody gonna have an opinion. And the internet allows the, the space for that to happen. All right, our final topic. Let's get into Lake Lanier here. What hey, nigga, nigga, stay off that water. <laughs> y'all know that that is a, a, a very... <laughs> I way. wish we could make that the clip name. Just stay off that lake, nigga. <laughs> You can. <laughs> That's the name of the show. That's the name of the episode. <laughs> hey man, stay off that lake. Like oh. every other week is something, and people have been petitioning because you know Tamika Tamika Smith. Uh, wait, that is not her name. Tamika Foster. Foster. Yep. Um, yeah. Usher's ex-wife. Who the fuck is Tamika Smith? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. Has you think of Tasha Smith too, wasn't you? Probably who looks yeah. really great, by the way. She looks so <laughs> good, but has been petitioning for them to drain that lake. Like everybody that is a man made lake that used to be Grantville uh, under, and it was a black town that they made people black town and Native American. Yeah, so that is that is that is why this keeps happening. When I tell you the ancestors don't play, they don't play. And they talking about making like a Margaritaville over there, all these different things. And it's like, I don't, why? And so there were a lot of people that signed that petition. Uh, Oscarville is what it was called, Oscarville. Oscarville, but okay. A lot of people did sign that petition to have that lake drain because there have been so many deaths that have happened on this lake alone. Yeah, so I'm going to read the type here. A Georgia man fishing at Lake Lanier drowned on Wednesday, marking the latest in a series of tragedies at the notorious lake rumored to be haunted. There were 13 deaths at Lake Lanier in 2023 compared to three at Altoona, the lake with the next highest number of deaths in the state. The victim identified as 73-year-old Matthew Mayo of Gainesville was fishing out of a bass boat with his wife at the time of the incident. When the man tried to sit down in a seat, it became unbolted from the floor and caused him to fall into the water. According to a statement from the Georgia Department of Natural Resources, Mayo did not resurface. Game wardens then located his body in six feet of water and Hall County Fire made a recovery of the body. So that's the newest one. Don't that sound eerie? Yeah, the, uh, the, uh, Atlanta did a whole thing on this, remember? I remember. Yeah. Yeah, just don't mess with this lake, man. I I ain't never I didn't even know about this lake in Georgia for real like that until like last couple of years when we you brought it to me last year. I had never really heard. Maybe I heard of it, but I didn't know it was happening. Always something. Always, I I have no. I listen. I would I would like to know we and we can pull those numbers. Because how far is it from Atlanta? Since right, like when did this? Late come into existence, like when they forced the town pe townspeople out. Nine twelve, nineteen twelve. So, how many deaths since nineteen twelve? This like ca late came into commission to now versus or resulting displacement of one thousand one hundred black residents from Forsyth County by white residents. Yes, the black residents comprise about ten percent of the population at the time. The current population is about four percent of the area's population. So 1950 is when they actually made the reservoir, though, when they made it. But they kicked all the black people out in 1912. So since 1950, when this town became submerged in water uh -huh. to today, I Let's wonder see. what that number is versus the neighboring lakes where they've had deaths. All right. So like, the construction in 1956, there's been 700 deaths at Lake Lanier. Okay. Um, so it looks like looks like it's just been picking up. Um, oh, just since 1994, 200 people have died of uh, late that's Lanier. That's a lot of people. Just since 94. Right. Dang. 39 died in 2023. Like this is an uptick this, these last couple of years. So this people, is people like when people have gotten in that water, they have reported people like people have said that it felt like something grabbed my leg. Dang. 
Like, and, and what about the guy that recently, like even before this, he got electrocuted? Oh, wow. Uh, so it's a professor. Like, wow. Like he fell off the, the dock or something and then got electrocuted into like going into the water. So I, I don't I don't understand why y'all continue to hang out here. <laughs> wow. So this is yeah, so this was this is a tragic history with this. So this is this is the ancestors tripping out. Made yeah. Oh, so okay, the Ku Klux Klan. Um, I don't even they, think they moved those bur like those burial grounds. No, they didn't. Um, mm -hmm. So they, I guess it was a, the the uh, eight. So in eighty seven, Ku Klux Klan people started a boycott at the integration of that area. In eighty seven, Jesus Christ, y'all took that long to get start boycotting. Okay. Um, yeah, so 700 people they saying have died since it was created. This is crazy. I mean, just leave this lake alone, y'all. Like, it, it, and look, let's just say all the people that we love and care about, y'all leave the lake alone because some people are just gonna do it because they think that they ain't they immune to that. Yep, we can't save everybody, y'all. We can't save everybody. No, I want to. <laughs> Oh man, Don, where can people hit you up at? Uh hit me up on Instagram at St. Angeles. Uh gonna be relaunching the candle store. I have a pop-up this weekend. Let's see if I like this. Uh, a little nervous. Uh oh, uh oh. Um Let's get but, it. Uh like I said, I still have the episode out about the us doing the review of Cowboy Carter and Dissected. Yep, yep. It is it a country album? What is it? Is it something that's experimental? You know, so we go a deep dive of that, as well as uh, y'all subscribe to my YouTube. I finally, I think I hit nine hundred hundred more, a little over a hundred. No, a little less because it's like a little over. I think it was like nine oh eight or something or nine oh three or whatever. Not there, you know. Uh, just trying to consistently crank out this content, uh, mapping out some episodes for Whiskey Sour. That'll be really, really fun and interesting for y'all. Uh, and yeah, girl. Yeah, and when I say girl, I mean girl, y'all. You know, my people, whatever. My people. Hey, y'all. If you like what you see here on Everyone Needs an Aquarius, be sure to hit that button right there. It'll take you to more clips and be sure to like, subscribe, and share our podcast. See you back next time.